Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. Hey, I'm Kayla. In today's video, I'm going to be talking to you about this app that I've used and maybe there's some good opinions, maybe there's some bad opinions, but I was just going to tell you about it and let's just get right on into it. Your head on my so today I wanted to talk about this app called Chloe and this is not a sponsorship or anything like that. I just wanted... I did it and I was like, it could probably maybe be a cool video idea until I got a new phone and I lost all of the videos of my wins that I got. So now you're just going to have to believe me and stuff like that. But I mean, if you've tried it and you liked it, that's great. So again, this is an app called Chloe. Um, and it's a, what is it called? It is, what, sorry about that. It is an app that you can play claw machines on and you win real prizes like as you saw in the thumbnail you saw one of the prizes and the backpack that I actually got right here is full of things and I'm just gonna go through and like necessarily I guess show you what I won but again talk to you about that so some of the stuff is really small and you can tell in the picture that it is small so like that's fine but there was a couple of things that first off didn't like show wasn't the same size comparison like they made it like an illusion so it looked bigger like they would hold it closer to the camera so it filled up more space rather than like holding it up to your body and comparing it to your body for instance if that makes any sense but so like one of the I don't even know what the first thing it was but like for instance this backpack actually I accidentally won this one I was playing a, a game well I thought I was playing a game for something else but then I was actually playing it on this this little prize so that was one thing I did not like about it is most of the prizes that were in boxes you used the same um what is it called machine I guess you could say and before I even played on the app I knew that it wasn't going to be good like good because like all of the reviews was like this is a scam blah 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 and a lot of people were talking about how they never got their prizes but they say you have to wait up to seven weeks to get your prizes because they're all shipped from China, which will probably show why the quality is so like cheap because that's like, it's made cheap, I guess you could say. And so, like I said, yeah, I got this little cat backpack on accident when I was actually trying to win like a musical box. So like that was annoying, but I have something else right here, but I love giraffes and I won this little bitty giraffe thing. You like can stick it to a was like a, a window or something and stick it in there but I just stuck it to my dresser mirror up there I was gonna show you guys um in the, the picture for this one it was you could tell it was small because like it was holding being held up like this so like I knew it was gonna be small and it was one of the least amount of coins to play and like it's a very it's cheap I will say that I think it's like two dollars for like 400 coins maybe I'm not really sure I don't have the app anymore because again like I have a new phone and stuff like that and then this was the backpack and it's honestly very cheap the straps are very small this is for a small child but again I just kept this because I wanted to show you guys like what all I got and stuff like that so I'll start with the stuff on the bottom because it's teeny tiny because that's the stuff that I was talking about a second ago and we'll go from there so there was three prizes or no you can win a prize and it's they're like the super easy ones like there's like a big clamp on it instead of like the three claws that come down it's like just like a clamper that does literally like this over the prize and so it was super easy to win these three prizes and i believe these were only 80 coins to play so like i can't be mad because it's like less than a dollar if you think about it but and you also get free shipping if you pay like a VIP membership for like $1.99. So of course I did that because I wanted to win enough things to show you guys. But I got like this little duck thing. It's from Pokemon. I don't know. Can you see him very well? Let's see. Just like this little duck thing. And like here's his tag. And then he has like this little Pokemon tag. And then we got a Super Mario mushroom that is purple. Just a little keychain. Again, Super Mario. And then nothing but Chinese. Which is fine. But 
you don't win the prize that you actually get. Like, um, this is what I think is, this is my theory of the whole entire thing is that you win the prize that looks a lot better than what you receive because like they will go and then buy it from another website for cheaper and then in turn get those that company or place to bring sell it not sell it to ship it to you and so that's why i think the quality is so different because i have two more things in my backpack that i was just like that just don't look right you know like it just don't look nice if that makes any sense the second thing i got was this i'm pretty sure this is a this is yoshi i could be so wrong i don't know my super mario characters and again it had the same tag super mario brothers and then that nothing is in china in china, oh my gosh nothing is in english except for like made in china and then the nintendo licensed by nintendo so i don't know if that's like really like for real licensed stuff but she's from china um the next thing i got was this and i know what this is i know what its name is and i cannot remember for my life but it's supposed to be a pencil bag but like the inside is so like cheaply made i don't know if you can see that like it's very cheap and like if you were to keep pencils in here like it's definitely gonna leak out and like leak through or not pencils like markers or something but it's it is like a cute little pouch like i bet like my niece would probably like love this and i'm probably gonna not keep any of this after this video but i just really wanted to try it out for you guys and also all of these things did come in the seven week mark it took it about six weeks to ship out but the last two things i wanted to show you and one of them was the one that i was just like ugh about because you can just tell it did not look like the picture is this it they didn't have a size description they usually were like i believe on this one they're like six inch whatever whatever giraffe whatever it's called and then this one they had to the camera like this so it looked big and you couldn't see like anything but like this and so i was like oh it's kind of a bigger plush and no it is the size of my hand but it is cute i do agree with that and then the second one which i know who this is this is pusheen with some potato chips and this one also looked bigger in the picture but i was okay with because like i don't need some big huge thing but i really this is honestly out of all of them like one of them that i actually wanted because i love pusheen Y'all know I got some Pusheen Funko Pops. And so I saw this and I had to have it. And it took me so long to try to win this. Because, again, I think they're like e-claw machines. Like a certain amount of money has to go in before someone actually wins. And you can tell that like right after someone wins, the claw gets super, super weak. And like you can just kind of tell. Obviously, they're just trying to make money. But like still, don't like do that. You know? Like just because we paint a two dollars for some some coins over here doesn't mean that you gotta scam us you know and like honestly like this honestly probably costs less than two dollars to make so you know what i'm saying like it's okay if you want to go the cheap route because like honestly for the amount of money i spent i should have better quality things on that app but if i were to be someone who's just like playing for the cheapness, I guess, because I tried Tariba and I was like, I am not paying $20 in coins to play like a couple of games because like $20 on Chloe was like a lot of games. And so there again, like that's where like the pros and the cons jump in. But and then I did show you the backpack. So out of everything, I think I played for like three months with intentions of showing you guys and like popping up videos and be like, and here's my win. But I don't have those videos so that sucks but basically the whole conclusion of this is like Chloe is good if you like cheap things if that makes any sense Chloe is not good if you want high quality things for cheap which exactly the you get what you pay for if that makes any sense and then they were really good with customer support though I will give them that so like I said there's pros and cons to it and if you try it out that's up to you but I'm just warning you that it's not that nice of things for such cheap little money if that makes any sense and so yeah that was the video for my Chloe experience and 
I'm not, like I said, this is not sponsored or anything because obviously I was kind of not being mean, but like just giving my honest opinion on the app. But I really wish I had those freaking videos that I could show you, like, because I have all the videos. I had all the videos on my old phone, and now I don't have that old phone. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and let me know down below what you think about this. Also, if you've tried Chloe, let me know down below, because I'm just curious. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell notification to be notified when I upload a video. And I'll see you later, guys. Bye!